The next tip I wanted to show you is how to adjust your power options and your brightness. These are a must uh, do for this computer. So because this computer's battery and um, brightness settings were limited by the factory default settings. So let me just show you how to do that. I will go to adjust screen brightness and you can uh, change the plan settings. What I would do is on battery, I would put it to two minutes to dim the screen, and then five minutes to shut off the screen, and then f 10 minutes to put it to sleep. And then I will put the brightness all the way down low. That's on battery. On uh, on plugged in, I would leave it five minutes for dim the screen and 15 minutes to turn off the display and to never put it to sleep and put the brightness to full if you want. Now, the most important part of changing the, the power settings is going to change advanced power settings. Click in there, scroll down to excuse me uh, scroll down to display and then go to um, enable adaptive brightness and turn off of all adaptive brightness settings so make sure it says off on on battery and off a of battery when adaptive brightness is um, activated it severely reduces the quality of the screen. At first I thought the screen was not as beautiful as it was and I thought that maybe I w thought the computer might not be worth it because I thought the screen was going to be beautiful which it is. It just needs to be adjusted. Once you adjust it, as you can see, the screen is incredible. It is very beautiful. There you go. So the screen is the best screen on any computer I told you in a previous video, it's the best thing about this computer. Its touch sensitivity is incredible, and the colors and the brightness are incredible. I actually have to turn down the brightness because it is, it is incredible. So, yeah, so that's how you make the screen incredible with the power options. And by the way, adaptive brightness, when you change the brightness settings on your own, and you even bring it down to the lowest settings, it still looks better than adaptive brightness. For some reason, adaptive brightness literally changes the way the screen looks, in my opinion. I don't know if I'm crazy, but I would recommend shutting that off. Next thing we're gonna wanna do is, um, wait, what did I wanna show you? Oh yeah, power options. So, let's go to power options again and choose what closing the lid does you can do that for yourself the power button choose everything that's important for you um, so let me just show you how to get there again so that's all personal preference for that one so I'll just show you how to get there so you right click on the battery button the battery icon and you press power options and you choose what closing the lid does so that is a very important uh, aspect to adjusting this computer when you first get it. Okay, hope you liked this video. If you did, please like and subscribe. More videos coming soon.